Right, question 17. So, oh, hello. Being a bit weird there. Okay, we're good in up to me. From the numbers above, write down a prime number, a square number, and a cube number. Well, first of all, we need to know what a prime number is. Now, a prime number, I know you remember it in your head as a number that only divides by one in itself. The technical definition, the good math definition, is that it's a number that has, uh, oops, it has only two factors. That means it only has two numbers that go into it. So it's always one and itself. It's always got to have two factors, e.g. The number two has the factors one, two, so it's a prime number, e.g. 17 has the factors 1 and 17, so that's a prime number. Twelve. Well, what number is going to twelve? So one, two, three, four, six, twelve. So is oh, so is not the prime number. Okay. And there's one final example that's always a good one. The number one as the factor 1 so is not prime and that's very important so let's look at the numbers up here and the numbers that have only got two factors one in itself well I know that 9 goes into here so that's definitely not a prime I know that 2 definitely goes in here, so it's got 1, 2, and 38, plus some others, it's got 39 as well. So this one that ends in a 5, so it's definitely got 5 in, as well as 1 in itself, so it can't be a prime. This one has got 1, and 7, and 10, and 5, and 70. It's got loads of factors, amongst others. Okay, so that's definitely not. So there's only this one left. So 1 and 29. So it must be that one. Well, we know 2 doesn't go in, we know 3 doesn't go in, we know 4 doesn't go in, we know 5 doesn't go in, we know 6, and so on and so on. And none of the numbers, the only numbers that go in are 1 and 29. Right? Right. Let's go to that. Let's look at square numbers now. Let's look at square numbers. So square numbers are the answer when you times the number by itself. So a calculation to all of these are all square numbers. So one squared or one times one is one, two squared or two times two, four, three times three is nine, four times four, sixteen, five times five. Oops, it's 25. Oh, look, there it is, it's in our list. So it's the answer we get when we times the number by itself. If we look at cube numbers, cube numbers are, are very similar. Except you times by itself three times. So it's one times one times one, it's one. 2 times 2 times 2, 2 times 2 is 4, 4 times 2 is 8, it's not in our list, so let's try 3 times 3 times 3, 3 times 3 is 9, times by 3 
is 27 and 4 times 4 times 4 I know I can hear you shouting I know it's in our list I'm just doing this calculation 4 times 4 is 16 16 times 4 is 64 and so on so we can see the cube number in our list must be 3 times 3 times 3 so the answer 3 cubed is 27